Hey everyone, this is Man in the Black Hat, and I'm back for more Let's Play Cave Story Plus on ResoWalkthroughs.com. And as you can see, there's a slight graphical and a major audio change for this, because I've decided that the rest of the game is going to be done with the PC version. And I spent all of last night getting actually all of this weekend getting all the way back to where I was. Unfortunately I forgot to get the bubble line. Oops. Oh well that just means I can show off a secondary place where you get it. And I also picked up a extra health packet. Now sometimes you'll see my screen pause on this for no reason. That's the computer deciding, you don't need to play this game right now. I don't know why. It just did. But yeah, the extra health packet that I missed is actually back in the corridor where you have to get all the way up to the top to hit the button to continue on. It's the very start of the labyrinth. And it's all the way on the far left. So now that you know that, hopefully you guys can get it for yourselves. If you've been following along. I did not know about that until I actually ran into it, so, yeah. Now, I don't know what any of these monsters are called, but damn. And yeah, the major reason I picked the PC version now, rather than the Wii version, is this epic music that you're hearing right now. You see, the PC version has enhanced music along with, you know, achievements. Which I may show off later, but not right now. I know there's an achievement for not blowing up any of these eggs, but eh, screw that. I can't be bothered. But yeah, the kick-ass music in this area. I'm sorry, but I call this worth it absolutely worth it. And as you can see, now we've got Curly Brace going with us. And yes, on the PC version, there's a way to play as Curly Brace, so... It doesn't do much. You don't get to have her bubble. It does give your main character, however, actual dialogue. So yeah, there you go. An awesome addition to the game. And yes, I've got this off Steam a while ago. Oh, I would also like to thank Hope Within Chaos for allowing me to finally get uh, Portal 2, thanks to a neat little thing he did for me. So, thank you to a member of the That Guy with the Glasses team for helping me do more Let's Plays in the future. I don't know when I'll get around to it, but I did want to give the guy a shout out for being such an awesome dude. Because, I'm sorry, being awesome like that, well deserved. And there we go. This is what I was talking about. No, I'm not going to edit those out. I don't care. It would also make the awesome music skip weirdly. And... You remember that one teleporter that was acting weird? Hey, look! We're back in the labyrinth shop. Let's talk to this guy. A witch and an enchanter locked us in here. It's not like she hates us. The reason she put us in the labyrinth is to protect some kind of secret keep and kept in here. But we doubt we have bad memories, so we forgot what it was we were supposed to be protecting. Sorry. And... That's pretty much all you can do here, aside from save. Or you can go out the door and grind for Dorito chips. Teleport is finally functioning properly again. Anyway, big deal. Its final destination is midway through the labyrinth. Yeah. The water section coming up that I'll tackle next episode. But, um, 
Other than that, you know. And hopefully I can get the water episode done correctly in one shot. If I can, I'll use that recording. All will be niceness. Otherwise, I'm going to be spending a lot of time making and deleting videos. Oh well. And yes, it's just been hectic. That's why you haven't seen many videos from me. I have not been up to it. I have no air conditioning in this house, and no air conditioning seems to be fairly common for San Diego. Wow, slow down. Anyways, in through we go to a dark place. Are we still in the labyrinth? Yeah, we are. We can't pass through here. We're gonna have to keep moving forward. Okay. Now, I highly recommend saving here. Because, as easy as this boss can be, you can still die stupidly. This is a strange place. Was it some kind of base? Um, yeah, actually. Open blast doors? Yes. Opening blast doors! Open the blast door. Open the blast door. Blast door number four. Currently malfunctioning. And over we go. This blast door. It's only open halfway. I think it must be caught on something. Now, what you're supposed to do is shoot the blast door. But I forgot since it's been a while since I did this. So, last door, number four, currently closed. Yeah, 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 we get it. So, over here we go. Shoot it a bunch. You hear the sound? Something breaking. Yay, blast door's open. Blast door after blast door. There's something behind all this crazy security. Don't you think so? Yeah. Probably something we don't want to touch. Oh well. Oh. Oh. Ah! Let me up! Lower lift. Lower lift. Yay! We can get down there now. Trust me, you have more than enough air to get through there. And bloop. Even if you stopped to take a whiz, you'd still have enough air to get through here. You only use about 50 units of air while you're down there. And... Open blast door. Opening blast door. Yay! Blast door's open. Blast door opened. And back through we go. It's going to... <sighs> Thank you, computer. Yes, I'm just going to deal with that. Again, it would affect the audio quality if I edited that out. It would give the song a weird jump. Oh, bunch of dead robots. And over we go. Look! A soldier from the surface. He's been nearly destroyed. There are others like this one all over the place. Who did this? It couldn't have been a Miniga. How could this have happened? It's still functional. Rebooting. Team 9 terminated. Unable to eliminate the target. Destruction of target is impossible with currently equipped for firepower. Retreat. Retreat. Ah, crip.
And remember what I said about doing stupid things? Yeah, this is what I'm doing. Something stupid. Like jumping into the water. And going after the sparkly. Ah, crap. Oh, no, no. And we're done. We are so done. Yep, donezo. You have drowned. Want to retry? Yes! Have to go through all of that again. So, ah! Yes, open the blast door. I don't really care. Yeah, I'm skipping the dialogue this time. Don't care. Yeah, we don't care. Anywho, as I've also posted on the site, I'm interested in doing a community Harvest Moon game. Yay. So I'd really like it if you guys weighed in on that. Let me know what you think. And, uh, what game you'd like me to play. Because I think that doing it where you fans get interaction on it is about the only way I'm really going to get that done in any meaningful fashion without it being boring to you guys. So yeah, this is fan interaction and what I will do is whoever picks an animal to buy when we have enough money to buy an animal will get to name that animal. So, the dog, and the horse, and whatever other animals we wind up having on that farm, you guys get to name them. The name of the character has already been picked. So, sorry. But, other than that, you get to pick what crops, you get to pick everything else about it. So have fun with that. I know I will. And now we gotta face this thing for realsies. Actually, it's incredibly easy with the machine gun. Because the machine gun will blast back the bits that it's, that it's using as blocking mechanisms. Way easy because of the huge damage output this thing makes. And as you can see, Curly Brace helps. She's helping! Really? You can only fire at it when it's got the blue bits exposed. And I think we're almost... Yee! Thank goodness for fast recharge. Ack! Darn it! This is not me doing this! Um... Yeah! Holy crap. Good thing Curly's invincible. Get up nice and close to it and start doing Mondo damage to it. You did it! Yes, we did! Ah! How? Hey! That's the same witch who zapped me. Are those children safe? Shut it. Don't act like you're a mother. Do you even know what this thing is? Huh? This is the reason why I hate robots. This is the heart of the island. The island will fall if this stops. Do you really want to die along with the island? You stupid fool. Misery. What are you doing? Move the core to the lab now. While you still have time. Whoa! Okay. Yoink this now. If you don't, you lose Curly. I'm telling you this right now. And let's just hang out until our air runs out, because we can't talk to Curly. 
and we also can't exit the room. And Dunzo. Losing consciousness, speaking like Shatner. Did you know the woman named Jenka had a younger brother? His name was Ballas. Like his older sister, he had a magical powers that unlike anyone could imagine. Huh, backstory. You can breathe. Hey, we got the bubble. No reply. She's not moving, but appears to still be alive. Will you use the tow rope? Yes. If you do not do these things, you lose Curly. Again, I will emphasize this. These are things you need to do to save Curly Brace and get the good ending. You also need to save Dr. Booster to get the good ending. Remember this. So, and we're done with this boss area. We're also pretty much done with this episode. So as soon as we get to a save spot, that'll be it for it. And cross your fingers on the next part. Anyways, this is Man in the Black Hat. And I'll see you next time for more Let's Play Cave Story on ResoWalkthroughs.com. Later.